This John Deere horse-drawn mower may look brand new, but it's actually nearly a century old, and it was recently brought back to life by Jim Quaid. I was raised in a tractor. For Jim Quaid, farming comes naturally. They call it a tumble buggy plow. Raised on a farm in South Dakota, he was driving tractors before he learned to ride a bike. I'd walk mold. Dad have a, had a field of 40 acres of hay. The 74-year-old is still farming, but recently switched gears. These old machines are good, you know, and they, they get the job done. Refurbishing vintage horse-drawn farming equipment to use on his Roundup property. This is a lot slower, but it's so much more peaceful and you get connected with nature so much more. He recently finished up this John Deere Big Four mower that he suspects to be nearly a century old. It's 80, 90 years old. But his restoration projects go way back to when he was living in Madison, South Dakota, working maintenance at a manufacturing company. I got a hold of an old McCormick Deering Big Six mower at the time and I got that working. He ended up moving to Buffalo, Wyoming, where he lived for 13 years before moving to Roundup nearly seven years ago. Well, after the hay gets cut and spread it on there again. Now his property is full of vintage farming equipment, waiting to be brought back to life. The wheels don't turn or nothing, so I, I do plan on redoing those. He keeps most of what he restores, but recently found others have interest in purchasing his projects. This one I have sold to a guy down in southern Wyoming. Which is simply an added bonus for the man who loves to stay busy. And see, it, I had to beef it up because it cracked right there. Always got to have something to do. Whatever it takes to get her done, I get her done, usually. Yeah. In Roundup, Kelsey Boggs, MTN News.